Hello and welcome to another one of those videos where I talk about updates on the Steam version of Dwarf Fortress, mostly coming from Toady and Kit Fox. However, I, I'm starting to seem like Toady, Kit Fox, and Reddit because Mef has shown up and posted again on the Dwarf Fortress subreddit and forums. And this time we have this post. Hi guys, I really liked the feedback on the weapon quality, so let's do that again. The instruments were just finished, and I was wondering what you guys think about them. Here are a dozen sprites for finished instruments in six different materials, and a sprite for each component. They don't assemble into a unique sprite because of the type of instrument in DF is fairly weird. Anything from a single rock, all that shakes, or a mix of something with a dozen components, that would make a mess of any sprite, which I completely agree with. So let's talk about the completed instruments here. I do have some issues with some of them, but generally I quite like them. So let's get into it. So let's start, start off by talking about the ones I don't like, and then I'll talk about what I like here. So this is kind of the first few rows of images. There's a lot in this post, so it's going to take a little bit to get through it. The first row of pianos, I'm not a fan of. They look like a modern piano and nothing like what I would imagine, imagine, imagine a dwarven keyboard to be. I would imagine something a little bit closer to a, a like a harpsichord or something a little bit more um, simplistic versus a modern grand piano. I'm also not a big fan of the kind of standing keyboards in the second row. I think that they look Again, way too modern. Like, that's something that I would see Dragon Force playing on, not something that I would see some uh, medieval dwarves playing on. That being said, I really, really like the bottom two, and I also really like the constructed drums. I'm not a big fan of the little feetsies on the bottom of the drums, but I think the drums do look very nice. I really like the little uh, stringed, uh, like, almost guitar-like instrument, but not quite. It looks much more medieval. I'm a big fan of the two harps, although I think the uh, constructed harps look a little bit too uh, fancy, personally. The horns are fantastic. Big fan of those. The little uh, wind instruments right above those with the tubes are great. And the bagpipes, well, they're bagpipes. I, again, I, I would wonder if they would have something as detailed as bagpipes, but because Dwarf Fortress's descriptions literally describe bagpipes, I can't really have a problem with those. And then I'm not sure what the one above that's supposed to be. It kind of looks like some sort of, like, press organ. Kind of, uh, but uh, I, it looks, it's kind of hard to tell what it is. So it's kind of a mixed bag for me. I think the kind of the top three Three rows here I'm not a fan of, but aside from that, the, the, I really like the rest. And uh, regardless, even the ones that I'm not a huge fan of, the exception of Carried V2, which I'm not super keen on, um, I think everything here looks really, really nice, pixel art-wise. Mavs art is fantastic, as we've seen previously. Just like with these previous videos, I will attach the Reddit thread down beneath the video in the description, so if you wish to go comment on these yourself, feel free. Also, feel free to leave any opinions you may have down in the comment section of the video. I'd love to read them and kind of chat back and forth with you. Uh, so here are some of the pieces that will go together. Um, the individual pieces do look different, but are going to be assembled into this one and the same instrument, uh, just because the, the dwarven instruments themselves will look kind of crazy. Uh, but because they are assemblable into like you know different instruments with one basic material, that will, I guess, assume uh, the color that they're going to be when finished. So, like, I, I once again like the way the keyboards look. The consoles have a nice little variation between the different materials. Same with the chest and the body. I also really like the looks of those. Um, the actual strings, I think, are a little bit small and might be a little bit different to difficult to distinguish from other things in the actual game itself, but, you know, might be a, a little, probably a non-issue, I, I would assume. Uh, things will stand out. Um, the uh, the bells, I, I would like to shout out the little head bell made out of bone. I think that looks really, really nice. And, um, yeah, all of these pieces are nice and easy to distinguish. Although, I will say, bellows and the pump just kind of looks like a weird blob at a distance when zoomed out. So, again, I think the uh, the visual distinguishability there might be a bit of an issue, but such is the way with DF at this point, I think. I mean, I did mention there was going to be a lot of stuff in this video, and yeah, there kind of is. There's the blowpipe, the bellows, the melody pipe, the drone pipe, bag, body, wind chest, pipe, and horn. I love the horns, once again. I think that looks amazing. The wind chests are a little bit, once again, kind of just difficult to distinguish, in my opinion. They just kind of look like a weird textured square, but again, I don't know how big of an issue that'll be, as you will be looking directly at them. Uh, I do, uh, again, really like the, the pipes. The bag looks like a chicken to me, or like a turkey, <laughs> um, which is kind of funny. Uh, and the ocarina, and the bodies kind of look like ocarinas. Uh, I mean, that's at least what's immediately coming to mind on these ones. 
All right, so now we're on to the different frames for the different stringed instruments. I once again really, really like the way the little guitars look and the bits and pieces of them. I like the the neck and the, the bow, I think, is a really interesting detail. Again, I think that the bow, the hammers, and the strings are all kind of kind of blend together into one. Same with the plectrum, but like, really, how are you going to distinguish these aside from just making them really small? Like, these are really small sprites. I know that I've seen some people on Reddit like kind of expressing like concerns about time, but like these have already been made. So I, I, I if I were to say do it again, I, I personally would go for more generic sprites personally, but that's just because that's what I'm used to with ASCII. I think this is going to be a really interesting kind of learning curve, kind of getting used to knowing what all these different pieces and bits are. It really goes to show just kind of how detailed this game is, and that's that's really cool to me. Uh, so yeah, strings, bows, plectrum, hammers, neck bowl, and the frame. I do really wish the harps looked, again, I a little bit less fancy to me. I don't know, but that's just me. Whew. Last one, I swear. Uh, these are the drums and the percussion instruments. So again, the, the bits and pieces, uh, I think we'll, we'll learn to kind of distinguish between them pretty quickly, but um, all of the hammet, hammers and the mullets kind of look the same to me. Same with the sticks. They all kind of blend together into one. Um, I, I think that the, the head of the drum, uh, again, looks like a food item. Uh, the triangle, uh, very small and hard to see, but it stands out unique on its own, and same with the drum stands. Although, I would like to note that I think it's weird that the drums have stands. Um, I A lot of, you know, older drums and stuff are things like gourds flipped upside down and um, more like solid standing things that would sit flat on the ground versus having an actual stand. So, like, again, I, I kind of wish with the drums that... Like, I like the look of the drums themselves, but it's weird to me that they sit on a stand. They look too modern. I think that's kind of my big concern with the, with the, the instruments that I'm not a fan of here, is they look too modern. And I really wish that they had more of a... Um like an old-timey feel to them, uh, less pristine. Like it, these almost look like drums that I would see in like a school band uh, presentation, and not so much a uh, uh, what's the word I'm looking for here? Um, medieval group, if you know what I'm saying. But now that you've seen all these instruments, if you have any feedback, once again, chuck them in the comments down below or in the Reddit thread, which I will attach. And uh, thank you very much for watching this video. If you made it to the end, cheers to you, and I will see you in the next one. Oh, you're still here? Well, I, I stream uh, a whole lot over on twitch.tv slash blindirl. I play a lot of Dwarf Fortress, roguelikes, and stuff of the likes. And uh, there's more YouTube content related to Dwarf Fortress on this channel than you could ever watch in a lifetime, because I archive my VODs here. Thank you very much for watching, and I will see you in the next one once again.